Hello everyone, welcome to another video. Um, I want to tell what happened after I left Jareen when I started a new life alone in Leta. Um, my old time friend um, helped me to find a room. Uh, I made also a video with her in my YouTube channel before. And my life was very simple at that time. I had a small room for rent for 2000 peso. In the beginning it was 2500. But then I found another room which was 2000. And then I told to my landlady that I will move to the other uh, room because I found a cheaper one for 2000 and then suddenly she, she uh, tried to keep me here and said that it's okay if I pay only 2000 so I stayed there for 2000 and also um, she gave me a new mattress because I said in the other room it's not just cheaper for 2000 a month but also there's a mattress and here at the room where I was I did not have a mattress so it was very uncomfortable to sleep on the wood frame bed so then she gave me a brand new mattress so you can learn from this that you can try to negotiate they will yeah, help you if they want to if, if they want you to stay there because it's not easy to find someone who will rent a room and yeah my life there was just um, a lot of walking especially in the morning when I woke up there was nothing to eat at the place where I stayed so I had to walk 30 minutes to the place where I could eat breakfast. So I ate breakfast for 40 peso. It was uh, like a street restaurant. And I think that was a soup, a spicy soup. And then I also bought uh, fried chicken from the street vendor. It was maybe five or 10 peso each. Then I. Um, I bought two pieces of chicken and then I continued to walk another 20 minutes to the next mall and in the mall I bought uh, fresh bread from a bake shop inside the mall that was a big white bread uh, still hot and I would um, eat it together with the chicken that I bought earlier so my my that was my lunch in the mall so my breakfast was around 40 peso and then my lunch would be around 20 to 30 peso so let's say 70 peso for breakfast and lunch I was staying in the mall to get uh, free Wi-Fi and sometimes I met um, some girls in the mall. Um, the one that I, I would check them first and then I would say I'm always in the mall. You can meet me in the mall if you want. And then I went, I was walking back home always like 5 p.m. before it gets dark. And then on the way home I would buy another fried chicken and um, rice that would be again 20 peso so in total for food every day would be less than 100 peso and the water is only I think 50 peso for three big uh, gallons of water that would last for a week or more 
so food and water was around 100 peso per day and together with the rent 2000 for the rent and 3000 for food and water i would spend just 5000 in a month and some little extra costs for the laundry service um, i think that was also not much because only once a week i would uh, wash my clothes there um, so in total it would be around 100 um, euro a month on my living expenses in this place but my life was very you can say difficult because i had to walk very far every morning to get food and then i was um, using a dating app to find new people and then after two months um, i met a girl on this dating app um, which was the girl where i stayed um, one and a half year later on where i made a lot of youtube videos so that was the time between Jareen and the last girlfriend that I had. Uh, from this time I did not make any videos because at that time I was not thinking about YouTube. I did not even know that I have a YouTube channel. I was very... Um, yeah, YouTube was not in my mind at all at that time. Yeah, that was the time between the, those two girls. And yeah, that's all for today. See you next time. Bye.